Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to another new video. Recently, you guys know that I was in Taiwan and uh, I was there for some time. I visited almost four cities in Taiwan. That is Taipei, Taichung, Kaohsiung, and Ilan County. So my experience based on visiting these cities was is the most important question is how do you communicate locally in Taiwan? Like if you want to ask me. Uh, how do you travel by metro or how you travel by bus or what is what is the other mode of transport if you want to take a cab or what is the metro that you have to take to go from Taipei to Taiwan airport that is Toyong airport which is also called as TPE airport so in this video guys uh, based on my experience from the last few days in Taiwan I'm going to share with you which is the best mode of transport in Taiwan like if you're looking to travel locally uh, in Taiwan I'm going to show you which is the best way and i would i would highly recommend to take this card which is called as easy card so i'll just this is the design you can choose whatever designs you want even you can get a photocopy of yours here and this is this indicates your easy card so this i got it in taiwan so i have to give you a lot of information regarding this easy card where it can be used how you can recharge this easy card and where can you carry this easy card i'll give you all the details guys so before i begin the video kindly watch this video till the end so that you get maximum information out of this video and this will be very useful if you want to travel travel to taiwan and this is a must know information because when i went uh, before going to taiwan i did a lot of research and this was one of the very most important thing so first thing how do you get this card you can go to any 7-elevens or you can go to any super uh, supermarkets or you can go to family mart which is very famous and you can just ask them i need an easy card so uh, before you get there uh, if you once you land in the tpe airport uh, you have to take a train going from uh, tpe airport to taipei if you're going to taipei like in the city if you want to go airport is about 40 to 45 kilometers from it was 45 kilometers from our hotel so the only cheap mode of transport was to go through via uh, high speed rails or via the mrt so now you can take it in the airport itself or uh, there is a way that you can go to a particular railway station uh, like a particular mrt which is all, which is also a local train so you can go to the mrt section in the tp airport and you can buy this easy card so this easy card is what we took this design it it is totally based on the design so for this design they it is chargeable around 150 taiwanese dollars which is close to 430 rupees change and it is preloaded with 100 taiwanese dollars and the charge for this card is around 50 taiwanese dollars which is around 135 to 140 indian rupees so if you take this uh this will not get you from uh taiwan airport to the city for that you have to take a separate ticket uh, which which is around 150 taiwanese dollars separately because this you cannot use it for the commute between uh the mrts which run from airport to your city so this can be used everywhere within the city except to the airport and you can also use this in buses and mrts and local trains so this is on the transport so these three places you can just swipe this card and uh, money will be deducted from this card now the most important question before i proceed to the next type is where do you recharge this there are multiple ways to recharge this guys so you can just go to any 7-elevens 7-elevens are everywhere in taiwan just like in thailand you can go any 7-eleven uh, give them how much of money you want and give the card they'll be able to recharge this so my suggestion is try to recharge minimum amount like 100 or 200 don't try to recharge very big depending upon your usage so this we used it in all the four cities and it was very convenient for us so please keep that in mind and the next uh, method is you can also use this in restaurants like kfc or pizza hut or they have a list of restaurants for easy card access i'll try to link it in the description below so you can use it there as well so just to recap you can use it in mrts local trains buses anywhere so basically the only place where you can't use this is if you want to commute between one city to another city so let's say you want to travel from taipei to kaohsiung there is a separate video that i'll be making on the tra that is taiwan railways that how to book those tickets and how to get those tickets i'll be making a separate video guys okay so please uh, stay tuned to that and if you want to use cabs there is another um there is another uh, way to commute within taiwan is to use 
cabs and that app is called fine taxi so i'll just uh, open it open it for you guys so if you see here so this is the app i was talking about this is the fine taxi cab so if through this fine taxi you can book your transport letting you can book your cabs from one place to another place but cabs are dead expensive so please keep that in mind even for 2 kilometers it is almost 400 to 500 indian rupees so it is that expensive guys so please keep that in mind before you book cab but if at all you want to book the cab you can book either uber or fine taxi which will be very convenient for you and this card like i said can be used in 711 let's say you bought uh, you bought any groceries or you bought lace and you can directly swipe this card this is accessible there as well so basically you need only one card to traverse in entire taiwan and this runs in all the cities it is very convenient for tourists like us because um you can carry one card for all modes of transport and it is this i experienced the same thing Uh, or, or like easy card type, like a tourist pass in Singapore. Because even in Singapore, you have just one card. But there, I did not use it in Seven Eleven or other local stores. I used it only for bus and train. And that, or in Singapore, you can use it from airport as well. But this card was very, very helpful for me, guys. And trust me, people are people are uh, people are uh, so fanatic about their own stuff. This is Pixie and Piske and Usagi. This is one of uh, one of the animes in Taiwan. and uh, they are big fans of this so the the better design or a different design this card will vary depending upon the design it is not uh, varying depending upon the type of the card one easy card is same everywhere just that uh, this is the lowest kind of thing we took this by default it costed us 150 and it is loaded and this card only costed us 50 taiwanese dollars so before you uh, before you book it keep please uh, keep that in mind and uh, like i said if you have any questions on taiwan transport please do reach out to me on instagram or comment in the comment section i'll try to respond to you as soon as possible so that's it guys that's it about this um, easy card where you can traverse and there is a list that i will share with you in the description on where this easy card can be used and uh, in singapore when you return this easy card like their own tourist card they will give you 5 to 10 dollars back depending upon when i went it was 25 dollars uh, which was unlimited for 3 days and then when i returned it they gave me i think 10 dollars back so that was a 3 day pass but this doesn't have any validity you can use it as many number of days you want and if i go to taiwan next time i can use this card as well this will be completely acceptable so when you're going to taiwan keep this in mind you can't order this uh, in from india itself i tried to find out through klu klu and waiter but this is not possible so when you're when you're traveling to taiwan ensure that you take it in the airport itself because it will be helpful for you and once you go from airport to the to the station which you're looking for uh, from there you can uh, you can take another bus or metro by using the easy card and also you can use this in supermarkets dining um, other social welfare services there's a lot of things guys i'll give you a list on where this exactly being used so please do keep that in mind in my next video i'll show you guys how to book uh, tickets from one city to another city in taiwan to the uh, to the machine that is available to the ticket machine that is available and i also forgot to tell you another thing there is also an easy card app if your phone is supporting of nfc you can just tap it and it will get recharged it is that smart so you can also recharge through app 711 in any mrt station or in any bus terminals you can definitely recharge this recharge this easy card so it is very convenient and we found it very very helpful in terms of we didn't ask anyone we just obviously googled it and i had done some research uh, before going to taiwan that which is the best card and we found easy card to be one of the best cards so again guys if you have any questions um feel free to com comment in the comment section or try to respond to this everywhere as soon as possible i hope this video was very very helpful for the people going to taiwan please share it with your friends and family whoever is going to taiwan and i'll catch you guys in my next video